tonight. A man's miraculous recovery after going on a wild ride when his truck was stolen. Mario Berger is accused of stealing the truck in Purcell while the owner of it was working in the back of it. News 4's Austin Brissett joins us in studio with an update on the victim. Austin. Well, Kevin, Purcell police say Nathaniel Austin Powell is alive and out of surgery. He has several broken ribs and other accident related injuries after Berger allegedly fled in his truck while he was in it, wrecking it and throwing him from the back and even running him over twice. The officers and the witnesses on the scene when I got there didn't think that Mr. Powell would survive and he was metaflighted to Oklahoma City, but fortunately uh, they were able to uh, get him through it. A scary moment at this intersection Saturday afternoon in Purcell where a stolen truck allegedly driven by this man, Mario Berger, ran a red light at high speeds with Nathaniel Austin Powell still in the bed. Another pickup truck that was making a left turn to go west on Wyatt Road uh, was already in the intersection making the turn and so they collided. Police saying it all started just about a mile and a half away. Austin Powell was working a job for his contractor and got in his truck bed to get some tools. Another man ran up, jumped in the cab of the truck and took off with him still in the back of the truck. Several people saw him traveling at a high rate of speed, going in and out of traffic. They eventually made it to the intersection of Green and Wyatt, where Berger allegedly ran the red light, hitting the other truck and throwing Austin Powell from the back. The truck actually ended up running over him, some of the witnesses say, uh, twice. Berger allegedly fleeing the scene, but witnesses pointed police to a concrete company across the street where they found him hiding out. He's in the McLean County Jail on numerous charges, including kidnapping, stolen vehicle, possession of uh, CDS, and uh, leaving the scene of an accident, and various other uh, traffic charges. Well, when police asked Berger where he lived, he said he had been kicked out of where he had lived at the time and claimed to be homeless. The situation is still under investigation, and as of right now, we're told Austin Powell is recovering in the hospital.